The options for treating Barrett's esophagus generally are limited. For the most part, surveillance is still entertained by most people. But for people who have bad reflux and, and relatively short segment Barrett's esophagus, often surgical correction of the reflux with an anti-reflux procedure such as a Nissen fundovocation will often make the Barrett's stabilize and in at least in eight or nine trials there's regression. So one way to do it is to really control the reflux. The gastroenterologists and others who are really in in, in to research with Barrett's esophagus have used anti-inflammatories and other medications to try and prevent Barrett's esophagus from getting worse or try to shut it down, but those are all research-based trials. Now, as a surgeon, we generally tend to look at people with bad reflux who might have Barrett's esophagus, and what we've noticed over time is that if we treat your reflux with anti-reflux surgery, people who have short-segment Barrett's esophagus uh, often get the Barrett's to heal, and it often regresses on its own, so uh, that's that's not a well uh, a well talked about treatment but the surgeons like to talk about it because there are eight or nine trials showing that with short segment so short segment Barrett's esophagus we can get it to stabilize heal and a fair amount of people it will go away just by treating the reflux with the surgery